Hello guys, and today I'm going to be showing you a um a redstone tutorial, and this one's going to be um the useless machine made by Seth Blank, but it doesn't have a cover up and it has a little bit of shown redstone. But yeah, it's kind of using a redstone bug since the piston under this pulses twice. Um. I'm not sure if it's a bug or not because it goes way too fast for me to understand. But I just know that it works. It doesn't work on the Xbox edition. I tried building it last night. And it doesn't work on in the Xbox edition. It has some different redstone mechanics on that. But basically we can put on this bedrock block. And it comes up, pushes it, and goes away. And yeah, I'm going to go show you... Well, I built it over here. If you, but if I had like say a different box, I had, I don't know, this will work for right now. But this, yeah, it would do that. But if you have like a bedrock box here, since they can't push bedrock box, or you just had it in the ground, since it can't push against another block, either you can have it in the ground or have a bedrock or obsidian block in the air, and then just do that. And basically, how you need to build it, and I'll show you, um, is I'm going to build it above ground since it's a little bit easier than digging out space. So you need to do, um, you need to have two bedrock uh, blocks up, and then you need to have a lever. Well, I mean, you don't need to put the lever there yet, but, um, and you need to try and put a piston like that. Then you need to have redstone wiring going like this. And I'm not sure. I just put it like ticks like this one too and then the other one um at zero. Well, don't touch it. Ticks or whatever. And then you have it like that. Oops, I don't have the repeater going the right way. Sorry guys. <laughs> I just placed the repeater the wrong way. Um and then you need to have this won't work if you don't have this part in. I think it might be using a bug or something. Because it won't work if you don't put this in. And yeah, so. We're going to make it wire up here. It doesn't matter if it connects like this. You just need to have it kind of like that. You need to have it go from the, the bedrock block. And then you need to have one. Well, I'm going to count it under the bedrock block. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then turn and then put a block here. And then put one more block here. Um, make it stand up. And then put a repeater here and a redstone here. And then that's basically all you'll have to do. And now it'll, it should work perfectly. And... Um, you don't technically, you need to have a sticky piston for the bottom one. You don't necessarily need to have a sticky piston for the top one. But, um, hold on. Um, let me see. Yeah, but, and then you can just pull it. And it does a job. Um, I actually just figured out that you could just use a piston over there too. You don't really need. Well, I mean, it, actually it would push the the thing out so you actually would need to have a bedrock block or underground too the same thing but yeah guys thank you for watching um time set um time set 100 um and yeah thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed this redstone tutorial remember this is kind of a copy and it does it's kind of like seth blings except if we go back to our normal copy it's right here it has one block of shown redstone i don't count the i mean it has two blocks of shown redstone and it has a slab up and yeah pretty cool and remember, it either needs to be in the ground or you need to have bedrock or obsidian here. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I hope uh, and I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.